Hey guys, what's up? So, Timmy Shun's Hot Bear Street. She's 5 11, 12, 13, 14. The first she's called Can't Reach Me. And what this tweet does, Can't Reach Me. Uh, custom actions for the uh, reachability gesture. This tweet's called Icon State. Preserve custom icon layouts between reboot. This tweet's called Nair Ride uh, Reborn. This tweet's called Nair uh, Red Reborn. Uh, Lost Green Music Player Redesign, Minimalist, and Album Cover as Background. Next she's called OWO. Um, OWO, what's this? Next she's called BioProtect Ets Ets. Um, now supports iOS 14. It allows you to put like, a passcode, face ID, or touch, or touch ID on your apps. So like, it's an extra layer of protection. Next she's called Ablaze. Uh, colorful Animated Music Backgrounds. Next she's called Copy Log. Uh, better iOS 14 compatibility. So it's a powerful clipboard history manager for iOS. Keep track of like everything you copied. This is called Snowboard. Also, want to read the copy uh, copy log. It fits uh, better handoff support. Fits iOS 14 paste occurred banners. Option to save all for iOS 14 banners. Favorites cleared button settings. Favorites activated open action snippets. Favorites activated clear action detection button dock icon replacement. New home screen icons for snippets. Other refinements and bug fixes. That's for copy log. Next week is called Snowboard. Snowboard themed engine. So for iOS 7 and up, it's theme your device. Next is called Auto Recorder Etz Etz and supports iOS 14. There's like a bug with this, just be mindful of that. Um, the developer is working on fixing that, but allows you to record voice memos, record calls, record system audio, um, record you know your voice, and record you know phone calls. So you know make sure you guys read the disclaimer and follow it. And me or developer is not taking responsibility if you guys use this tweak. Just make sure you guys comply and follow the laws. You know wherever you are. It does cost three dollars ninety nine cents, so it's one of my favorite tweets, to be honest. Next tweet is called Quick LS, uh, make your lock screen even more speedier. Next tweet is called Siri Voice Settings, tweets Siri's voice. Next tweet is called AOD, do not install this on iOS fourteen, guys. Warning, do not install this on iOS fourteen. iOS twelve and thirteen should be fine. So cool, always on display. Um, this is, I think we're putting like a boot loop for iOS fourteen, just until it gets updated. Do not install this, which is version six point four. Next tweet is called Atson, uh, now available at Repo. Uh, .co.kr fits dark mode toggle. Uh, priority help with iOS 11, 12, 13, and 14. This is called Ball Appy Simple Data View. Simple Data View. Change your lock screen data date view. This is called Frame. Um, range your iDevice Life with the true video wallpapers. This is called Carrier Crack, Carrier Crack uh, Global. So this is you know input hidden features, do interest new so, uh, features, amplify cell signal, amplify data speeds, and more for your you know your data. This is iOS 13 version, and this is the iOS 14 version. It was just updated, so this is basically um, iOS 14 only supports T-Mobile as of right now, but for the USA, but it is getting updated to support more. Also costs two dollars and ninety cents, but definitely worth it. This is called No More Deleted Call Talk. Uh, no More Deleted Call Ka Talk Message. This week is a theme called iOS Ets. It's actually 70, 50 percent off, limited time for uncover release. That's what it looks like. This is a theme called Onyx. And it's a theme. This is called Lobelius. Redesign your lock screen player. This is called Screen Dump VNC, Virtual Network Computer for iOS. Supports iOS 12 and 13. You could run iOS 14, but you do have to do like different uh, steps for that. So, this is called Magma Evos. I see a giveaway for this. This is the latest uncovered release. They're um, giving away some Magma Evos for free. It redefines your control center. This is called Linux 2 Ultimate device, iDevice Customization for iOS 14. This is called Apps Manager, uh, provides a way to wipe back up, restore app data from installed apps. Also one of my favorite uh, tweets, um, I believe it was updated to support iOS 14. This is called Files of File Manager, also Files of File Manager 64 bit, and it's a file manager for iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, supports iOS 7 and up, should support the latest iOS 14 version uh, with the jailbreak. So just let you guys know, this is by far also one of my favorite tweets, and this is a tweet that you must have, just, you know, it, you have access to your whole file system, just all, you know, IPA, .deb, so this is... You know, this is a great tweak to have, and you know, definitely recommend this tweak too to have. She's called Chat Bubbles uh, Light, inspired by Android 11 Chat Bubbles. This she's called Calm, uh, your beautiful first sight. This she's called Anywhere Widgets for iPad, allow widgets to be on the home screen on the iPad. This she's called Home Plus uh, Pro Beta, and do 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 uh, revolutionary layout edit for iOS. So it looks. This is called Multiplot Power to Your Dock. This is called Sonar Reborn. Uh, uh, Breach widgets on iOS 14 and 14.3. Be mindful of that. 
but it allows you to have those trans transitions when you guys uh you know swipe or scroll this she's called smart notifications two or smart notifications and it customizes your notifications the way you want This is called Fletch Decrypt, mainline tool for decrypting match O binaries. This is called Puck. Also, I mention that Fletch Decrypt does not work in iOS. You uncover iOS 14. Um, this is called Puck and prevents the need of re jailbreaking. This is called Dyadic and combine the Today page with the Control Center with new gestures to open up Control Center. This is called Complications, Apple Watch widgets on your iPhone lock screen. And the last tweak is called Fly JBX. I see it might be two more tweets. You can hide to your jailbreak eye device, which means you can bypass jailbreak detection for you know your apps and games. This is called Cozy uh, Badges, and Cozy Badges for your uh, place for your badges. It removes the boring uh, default badges with the peer that you have notification on your app instead of replacing with the colorful labels. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace.